Hi, this is MTV214 with Halloween approaching. I wanted to do another Halloween scary figures related video. This one will be specifically about with DC figures. So I didn't get these figures right now, but I didn't want to show them off with it being that time of year. Halloween. So I'm going to start off. These are just accessory sets there from uh, Frankenstein from Figure Obscura and some other random things. But um, this is the Nightmare Bat build a figure with the Batman wave that had the Riddler, Jim Carrey Riddler, and Tommy Lee Jones two things. So this is the Nightmare Bat. This thing is huge, scary, Halloween related that it's a bat. And it's huge, so I just wanted to show that off. And an older thing, which is like Halloween related. This is, it's not really the Batman, it's the motorcycle. It's like a giant skeleton bat motor motorcycle. And that's the death metal Batman on it. But uh, this is more about the, the bike. You can see the ribs, the spine there, more of the spine on the back. The skull with the eyes. It would be cool if these eyes lit up or glow in the dark. You could put glow in the dark paint on that, but it's definitely cool. Halloween related. To have the scary bike. And let's see some more. Another bat related figure. This is the man bat. I think there's like a comic related one, but it could be sort of like the TV show, the animated series, or however you want it as. So, the articulation is okay. The arms single jointed. It's not connected with these parts here, but um, once you get in position, just leave it as is. The head has some movement, can go back and forth. The mouth, unfortunately, isn't articulated, but I saw someone make this articulate, cut it, and do something to it. It has articulation, the torso, the stomach, the pants seem to be a bit higher, the legs can go forward and back, has double jointed knees. This thing has trouble standing with these little ankles. They can go forward and, like, you know, rotate forward and back. It's toe articulation. So this is a cool figure to have. It's Halloween related. Let's put him back a little bit more. See, he can't stand up. This figure is a problem to stand. Okay. And other stuff is falling because of that. That's his problem. He can't stand too well. Okay. It's slipping fell down, right? Yeah. The candle that was on there. Okay. Move that over. And there's a few more. This is from like Darkest Night. There's Death Storm. There's like a skull face and like flame hair. So he was like sort of a scary figure for Halloween. And uh, there's a few others that go along with him. I sold the Builder figure, which is like Atrocitus, where I traded it, but I kept the other ones. Green Lantern just looks normal, so he's a pass. Here's the Batman one, Black as Night Batman. He looks sort of like a zombie, like look at that mouth, open like that, and the eyes. The body is like sort of not that weird. It has like the same design like him. He has... These going up, so oh, here's another scary Halloween really. It's like a zombie Batman. And this one looks even more zombie-like, Superman. So he has that same design there. The face, look at those teeth. The eyes are like sunken in. It's like a zombie face. The arms are sort of shriveled skin and the hands as well. But the arms, you could definitely see. But the body has this tattered cape. Another Halloween related figure. And lastly, one more, Vampire Batman. So I didn't like 
the Joker version and the Batman version, like all this. This is the one that really spoke to me, the vampire version. So I, I got him. This Batman has gray skin, the teeth, the blood, at the mouth, those like red eyes, scary face, pointy ears, the sharp nails on the hand. The other hand has a fist. So this is another cool figure that's Halloween movie. I just want to show off some the scary things with Halloween coming up. Well, thanks for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, check out my previous videos, and happy Halloween!